This free perfect trading view indicator is capable of skyrocketing your win rate exponentially to the next level. All you have to do is to bring up the indicator on your chart, do some necessary settings, then you can use it for your long uh, and short position while trading. So as you can see, it's a non-repent indicator. When it prints a precise buy signal, we got a massive push of price to the upside. A sell signal, we got a price move to the downside. A buy signal. Now we got a price up and a sell signal got a price down likewise a buy signal we got a massive push of price to the upside this has been tested and trusted now in this video i'm going to show you how to bring up the indicator on your charts and also how to do some necessary settings and lastly how to use it for your long and short position wide trading before we move on in case you're new to the channel don't forget to smash the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notified anytime i drop a new video and also please guys don't forget to like the video before you leave now how do we bring up the indicator on our charts what are the indicators indicators we are to bring up on our chart and what are the necessary settings that needs to be done before making use of the indicator for a long and short position while trading so to bring up the indicator on our chart you click on the indicators you click on technicals technicals so when you click on technicals you type in linear linear regression candle so as you can see right here mine is already favorite uh, for the right mine already you can choose to do the same if you wish to so you can see linear regression candle by ugroof make sure you select the exact indicators being shown to you in this video so when you've seen this indicator you just tap on it once make sure you tap on it once so if you tap on it once it will automatically appear on your chart so when you have done that you just erase it and type in the second indicator which is the ut bolt alert ut space bolt so if you just type in ut bolt this way you would see the full indicators will be suggested to you which is the ut bolt alert by quant no man as you can see right here then you just tap on it once automatically it will appear on your chart so now we have bring up the indicators on our chart what are the necessary settings that needs to be done before making use before we'll be able to make use of the indicator for trading so right now guys what we are going to do is to click first of all click on the linear regression candle so when you click on it you um you click on the settings make sure it's on input on the settings you reduce these um signal smoothing to il to seven okay you reduce it to seven then this one um, the linear regression length you leave it at 11 make sure these two are checked so when you've done that you click on the style make sure the linear candles are checked the green and the red as you can see right sorry i don't intend making the video lengthy guys so scroll to the bottom you see the plot make sure the plot is checked okay make sure the plot is checked and make sure these two right here are also checked so on the plot you click on the plot to increase the length the size of this are uh, um of, of our linear regression can do then you increase the size as you can see right here is a little bit bold right now as you can see right here so we can see it clearly when analyzing our chart so when you have done that the next thing to do is to click on the visibility so as you can see there's nothing to set up here then you click on ok so as you can see we have we are done with the linear regression candle settings so the next indicators to set up right now is the ut bolt alert you click on ut bolt alert click on cell tints make sure it's on input the, on the input you um you switch from the one to two make sure you change this to two so when you've done that you reduce this to one make sure it's reduced to one so when you've done that you leave this and uh, signal from high current Hiken and Ashi candle leave it unchecked so when you have done that you click on the style okay you click on the style you uncheck the bar color now when you click on the style you just have to uncheck the bar color so when you have checked um, the bar color you click on ok so now we are done with the settings on our indicator boys we are still left with one settings to um do before we can make use of the indicators so you have to head over 
up you have to go up a little then you see this three dot right here just follow my arrow my mouse then okay so when you click on the three dot you click on this height just tap on it once so you can see our indicators is good to go right now as you can see it is so smooth and easy to understand right here when the price is above the linear regression candle it means um, it's a it signifies a bullish signal when the price is below the linear regression candle it signifies a bearish signal so that is how the linear regression candle works now talking about the UC bolt a lot talking about the UC bolt a lot when it prints a precise buy signal it means we can long our trade and when it prints a sell signal it means we can short our trade now to take a buy trade or a long position we we'll first of all need to wait for the price of the asset to trade into our map out liquidity price point area here right here which also serve which serves as the demand zone so this zones these two zones right here are liquidity price point area when the price gets to any of these zones right here we likely get a price rejection to the upside or the downside so take notes pay close attention to these two zones right here so now guys let's wait for the indicator to print a buy signal for we to enter a long position right here so sorry i don't intend making this video lengthy guys So guys as you can see we just got a precise buy signal which means we can enter a long position right here as you can see right here so now before we could enter a long position first of all we need to map out our take profit target areas which i'll be using this candle as my take profit target one and uh, my take profit target one and also take profit target two area guys okay so let me quickly map out my take profit target one and also take profit target two area remember i said i'll be using this particular candle to map out my take profit one target so this will serve as my take profit one target let me change the color to um yellow why my take profit target two will be slides above my take profit target one so i'll be using this as my take profit target too then i'll change the color to green so what i'm going to do next is to map out my long position entry right now let's bring my stop loss below it at this um demand zone right here then i'll take my um my take profit target to my take profit target too okay so i'm going to set it right here so you can choose to do your own your own way to your liking so this is how i choose to set up my own take profit targets area so we to wait for the um uh, take profit targets to get hit so that we can enter our short position right now guys okay so let's exercise patience why um to see if our take profit targets will likely get hit soon okay so like i said we just got a buy signal and we are heading straight up for our take profit target one so as you can see our take profit target one got hit and the price got rejected and you can see we are heading straight up for our take profit target two right here as you can see our take profit target two just got hit and the price kept on going and going girls so this is how you can take a long position for this trade as you can see the indicator prints a precise buy signal and we set up our take profit target one right here here and i take profit target two right here and the two take profit targets got hit instantly as you can see right here so this is how you can enter your long position while using this indicator the linear regression candle indicator and the ut bolts a lot in order to take a sell trade or a short position first of all we have to wait for the price of the asset to trade into this map out liquidity price point area here right here which you're seeing right here which serves as the resistance zone remember these two zones are price rejection zones take note of that this two, these two zones which is the resistance and the support zone are always the price rejection zone guys so we need to take note of that that is why i've chosen to map out this price point area as my liquidation price point area so what i'm going to do right now is to wait for the price of the asset to trade into this zone right here to get a sell signal for me to enter my short position or my sell trade so 
so what i'm going to do now is to exercise patient for the price of the asset to trade into that map out um liquidation price front area right now to get a sell order for me to enter my short position so let's fingers crossed and watch how the indicators is gonna do right now guys So as you can see guys we just got a precise sell signal since we have gotten the precise sell signal the next thing to do is to map out our take profit target one and also take profit target two area so i've mapped out my take profit target one area and also take profit target two area so i'm going to enter my short position right now so i'm going to enter my short position right now so i'll have to drag this to my take profit target two down to my take profit target two remember we are entering a short trade and then this to um the preset um, below the the liquidity price point area okay so as you can see we just fit in okay so we'll have to take this one a little bit up okay so as you can see we are good to enter our short position right now guys so the next thing to do is to wait for our take profit targets to get hit and if it fails to get hit and uh, the price should bounce back automatically this would be a stop loss okay so what we are going to do now is to wait for our take profit target areas to get hit real quick so the indicator just touches the tick but as you can see we are heading straight down for our take profit target one to get hit so as you can see the indicator just take touches our take profit target one and got a bounce back remember i say this zone right here always serves as a reprise rejection zone as you can see right here profit target one we got a, re a price rejection to the upside immediately as you can see right here so this is how you can take a short position while using this indicator the linear regression candle indicators and the uc and the uc both indicators